Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Ramadan Mubarak for all my Muslims out there worldwide. I pray that Allah showers us with blessings, with knowledge, and with insight during this illustrious month. I mean, dear believers, as you know, fasting was prescribed upon us, just like it was prescribed upon those before us in order for us to attain righteousness and piety. Now, if we look up the word prescribed in the dictionary, we will see that it means to order or to designate the use of as a remedy, as a, as a, as a remedy. Now, knowing that this was prescribed to all of us, that should tell you right there that we all are sick and we all are in need of this remedy. Just like medicine, it can be extremely hard, difficult and painful to take. But the benefits of that medicine that we that we need at that time that we're taking it far away anything we'll go through anything in order to take it because we need it fasting is the same way we actually need fasting and it can be extremely difficult it can be extremely hard and it can be extremely painful at times but the benefits the benefits far outweigh any inconvenience that we may suffer fasting and we're doing it for a lot that's the most important thing. And not only that, fasting was prescribed upon those that were before us. So that means all of the prophets, some of the most righteous people that ever walked the face of this earth had to fast because they suffered from the same things we suffered from. And they benefited from fasting just like we benefit from it. We fast in order to wipe away our sins. We fast in order to keep us away from the hellfire. And we fast to, inshallah, get us into paradise. Now, somebody came up to the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and they said, instruct me to do an act that will make me into paradise. And the Prophet said, stick to fasting. There's nothing like it. Mashallah. I pray that we all achieve success and all of the benefits and blessings that we attain this month. I pray that we are able to use them on, on the, in this life and in the hereafter. And I pray that the knowledge and the wisdom that we get from the Quran, we are able to use it in our life and teach it to other people so that they may also attain success. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Da 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 da